Good morning. <laughs> um, this morning, the kids just ate breakfast. They're hanging out over here. Good morning. But this morning, I am busy cooking away. Ella, honey, make sure you put on something warm and socks, please. Um, I gotta go strip their bed and stuff and everything. Today is Sunday, so it's kind of a casual day. We're gonna head to Walmart in a little while. Um, we have, we, I just gotta go get a few things, but I wanted to just basically make a bunch of pancakes using this thing. Um, so I'll show you exactly what I do. I mean, it's so self-explanatory. I do spray it with a little bit of cooking spray. So I am just obviously putting the pancake batter right on the griddle after letting it preheat and I close it. We're gonna set the timer for three minutes. So I cook it for three minutes on this side and then when it's done, I flip it and cook it for one more minute and that's how I've been getting all of these. But I figured I would just make like a whole bunch of kind of pre-made pancakes and put them in freezer bags. That way, the heck that way in the morning because my mornings are already so hectic trying to get hunter what on earth i have a feeling that's paint <laughs> um i still have to paint today so it doesn't really matter i guess but my mornings are already so hectic between trying to get hunter to daycare and ella to school i just sort of figured it would make our lives a little easier <laughs> that way we just take them out of the freezer and heat them up for a few seconds in the microwave and you have a pancake a nice and warm pancake so i'm just trying to do little things to make my life a little bit easier it feels so good to vlog again to guys it really does it, it's amazing so um we're gonna finish up here i'll bring you guys to the store with us and then oh do you know what we're doing today two things we still have to open up hunter's two birthday presents we're gonna do that probably when we come back from walmart but i actually found this gorgeous piece of furniture on facebook marketplace and it's massive and will barely fit but it's gonna be really hard uh, maybe i can show you guys it's gonna be really hard to explain what I, i'm doing i think without actually showing you guys but I have this area right here. Obviously there's a desk, but it's just in the worst spot possible. It's not practical because let's say hypothetically you're sitting here. There's only so much room to get into that room. So it's not the best place for a desk. So we are actually going to be taking this storage closet out. You can see all my X's and stuff. We're gonna be basically taking this storage closet out making it like a little desk area so so essentially this will all be gone um i don't even think i'd be using this desk again so maybe it can go in my bedroom maybe i can save it for hunter i'm not sure yet but the big piece is gonna go here because once this is gone this is a big space to fill so oh my timer is going off but this would be a big area that i need to fill uh so i found this gorgeous piece of furniture oh hi honey let me help you come here come here ready let's sh shimmy it out no, i don't want to make you fall come on wait, wait. Da -da. Da -da 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 -da. okay you good we got it okay that scared me <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> okay so i found a really gorgeous piece on facebook marketplace and it's only a hundred dollars and when you guys see this piece of furniture it was such a steal so really quick i just i'm sorry i should have showed you guys i i just flipped it and i set the timer on for one more minute we got a little bit to do this morning but i will bring you guys for the ride and then uh, i think actually tonight amber and i are gonna go out for some drinks too um so i'll put on like a cute outfit or something i don't really know but We'll see what today brings us. All right, so we just got back from uh, Target. I forgot where we went. I'll show you guys like a little super quick haul. Um, so I wanna show you these to get these obviously out of the way, but I needed some new knives. So I just got a set of those. It was like, I don't know, 15 bucks or something. Um, I also got this, which we're gonna set up and let Hunter and Ella play in. And then I just needed a few miscellaneous stuff. Um, I gave away all my snacks 
to the daycare, like to keep in Hunter's little cubby. So I needed some more snacks for the house. So I picked up some Sammy Jammies. I think these are, they're peanut butter and strawberry, like little snack bars. I'm not sure. He hasn't tried them. I don't know if he's going to like them. We'll see. I also needed some fluff for Ella's um, school lunches, some more pacifiers, because we go through these. No sandwiches. What do you want, sandwiches or, pi or pizza? Some freezer bags for those pancakes we made this morning. And then just a whole bunch. And just a whole bunch of different yogurts. And we still gotta open your presents, dude. We still yeah. gotta open up your presents, kid. Let's do that right after that. Right after I blow this up, we'll open up his presents. Oh, this, this green marker was really hot. Oh, sweetheart, I need to open the box first, my love. You wanna help me? You wanna help, mama? Extra, but it came with them. Now, <laughs> where did you put the extra balls? I have no idea, to be honest with you, honey. Oh my gosh, mom. We don't need them. We got more than enough. All right. I don't think I have. I have a pump somewhere. Oh my gosh. I don't even know. All right. Let me still go see if I can find the pump real quick. Okay. Yes, I'm talking about you, you little thing. <laughs> All right, I found my pump. <laughs> hey, hey! <laughs> okay, I'll talk to you guys when I get this pump. <laughs> He's more interested in the instructions than the actual toy itself. She wants the toy. Dad, uh, wait, this is a little stand-up area where you can... Sweetie, <laughs> I think you're a little big. <laughs> Yay, <laughs> we're gonna open our present. Ooh. Ooh, let me get started for you, baby. Look. <gasps> Go ahead, baby. Right? Ah. This one too. <gasps> See that one too. Eva, here go, baby. Ready? Woo. Ready? Nice big one. Ready? Oh, yeah! Very nice one. Ready? Go ahead. Rip it, baby. Do it. Oh, I'm going to it. Let's see if I can turn it on. <clears throat> Okay. All right. He's completely lost interest, but we're gonna get oh, these open. He's too. I think I'll come back here. Okay. So I got this piece of furniture Sunday night, a couple nights ago, off of Facebook Marketplace for a hundred dollars. That's it, a hundred dollars. So I am working on kind of putting it together right now. Um, I'm gonna get some of those baskets, actually the same exact baskets that Hunter has uh, over here. I'm sure you've seen them before, right there. Those kinds of baskets. And I'm gonna put a couple of them under here for Ella to keep stuff. But yeah, there's actually a third section too, but my wall is not big enough. So it's supposed to have like a whole nother 
one of these. Um, but we just used the two for now. It has lighting up at the top, which I haven't plugged in yet, but right now we're just kind of figuring out <laughs> what looks good, what doesn't look good. Um, but yeah, super adorable. I love these little pineapple bookshelves. I don't know, I just wanted to show you. You guys can find such good stuff on Facebook Marketplace. Like, are you kidding me? I jumped on this offer so quick. I logged on to Facebook. This was posted maybe two minutes ago and I messaged a girl so fast. I'm like, I'll pick it up now. And then we made plans to pick it up. But she's like, I have tons of offers, which I could see why, you know what I mean? But mama got it. That's right. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Oh my gosh. And then, did I even show you? Oh, honey, are you okay? You scared the poopy out of me. I gotta feed him too. But I don't even know if I showed you guys that, uh, kind of went crazy <laughs> I kind of went crazy uh yeah so instead of having my my desk here I thought it'd be really cute to take out this kind of storage closet under the stairs and we're like gonna build in like a sh uh, desk and like we had ideas to drywall half of this and then like build shelves on the other half kind of thing I don't know. I'm really excited about this project, to be totally honest with you. I think it's so cool. I don't know. I really like it. Anyway, I gotta go keep eating and dye my hair and feed my cat. Hi, baby. Hi, honey. Come here. Let's eat. I think I still have half a can of food. Yes, I do. Oh, gosh. All right. Hi, honey. Oh, my goodness. Hey, Pippi. Oh, he's rubbing against my feet. <laughs> Mom, where were you? Oh, baby, I was outside dealing with the nasty snow. Yeah. Yeah, I was, mister. Yes, I was, honey. Yes, I know. I know. Okay. I know. Sorry. <laughs> We do this every morning, little buddy. <laughs> I'm never not gonna feed you. Oh, you know what? I gotta get there. Put that there. I gotta get you more water. It's been a while since I dyed my hair. So this is this is the hair color that I dyed it last night. You guys can't really see it very well because I only have one light bulb up there to show you, but it is lighter. My natural hair is like a very well, in the summertime, it gets very golden, like kind of like a honey brown, but like naturally my hair is kind of just a dark chocolatey brown, very boring. Um, I've honestly always wanted to know what I would look like if I went like full on blonde or like a dark blonde. That's not what we're doing today, but um, it's something that was just kind of always in my mind. So I'm like, well, what if I just start lightening my hair and seeing if I just like a lighter brown? Um, so I did, again, I did dye my hair last night, but... I wanted to be able to, where did I put my, this, these gloves came from my hair dye box from last night. Um, I'll show you, but I got one of these again. So I'm using the dark ash blonde and it's cool tone. So I don't know. I mean, I like the color. I just, I can definitely see just spots that I missed so I can't see all over and really determine if I like this color or if I even want to take a step. Like I almost debated on just bleaching my own, my whole head and then putting like a really dark blonde or a really light brown uh, ooh, all over that. I was trying to avoid bleach at all costs because I am still trying to grow out my hair. This is the longest it's been since like high school because I kept cutting it up to like here especially after I had kids you guys know if you've been long uh, here long enough uh, let me get the box let me get the new box the last time I dyed or really even trimmed my hair was when I put in highlights like uh, too, too too long ago to be comfortable to admit I definitely need to try to focus most of this dye around my ears. Um, I did try my best, honestly, to be as thorough as I could last night. Um, I really did take my time, but it happens. Honestly, I recommend if you're if you're doing this at home and you're go, going, not even a totally different color, but um, it, I just think it's always a good idea to maybe go over it again, um, at least for that first initial coloring, because uh, there's, 
Hello. So I got all the spots that I felt like I missed. So this needs to start processing for 25 minutes. So I'm gonna start a timer, but I'm just getting the rest of my hair. I didn't wanna go over it all. Um, maybe that's gonna be a mistake, I don't know. But in my mind, I was trying to spare my hair as much damage as possible. Um, so I'm just going to tie it, get it out of the way. Hmm. And then we will see, uh, again, We will. I used not even half the bottle. So we will see how much coverage I can get on my extensions. Um, it's not bad, like I'm not hating it, but it's not what I had in mind either. I may regret my next decision about going to the store and getting bleach and oh, I'm a little nervous, but you know what, at the end of the day, if I completely screw up my hair color, yes, I'm going to damage my hair, but like, I really don't do anything with my hair like ever. I figure if worse comes to worse, I will just dye it dark brown again and pretend like nothing ever happened. So I, <laughs> my one goal is not to end up on Brad Mondo's channel. So after the second dyeing of my hair, it really didn't change very much. Excuse me. Um, yes, my roots lightened up, which was my goal, but this is not necessarily the color that I wanted. I want it to be a little bit lighter. So I think what I'm going to have to do, and I may be totally wrong, I don't know what I'm doing, is go in with some bleach. And this is when it's getting scary. I think I'm just going to have to, oh my god, I just dyed my hair to bleach it to don't come after me, please. Just watch the train wreck uh, unfold. But I got these flat lightning bleach. Honestly, there wasn't like anything to choose from. Um, I found like two bleach kits, so I just picked one. You know what I mean? We have like three different packets here. We have complete shampoo. So we obviously know what that's for. Deep reconstruction, which I'm assuming is some sort of conditioner and the lightning. This is what is going to lighten my hair. So let's go ahead. Ooh. Try not to breathe that in when you're opening it. Ooh, it's like a blue. I don't know if you can see that at all. I've gone ahead and bleached. I wrapped my hair in plastic so it could uh, process a little faster, but it's already, it's already lightning. I did not have enough bleach for my extensions too, so I'm gonna have to go back and get one more box. But the store that I went to only had two boxes. I got the only two, so I'm gonna have to go somewhere else probably tomorrow um, or even later tonight. I'm not sure. I don't really want to leave the house again, but we'll see but yeah i'm gonna check on this every like 10 minutes or so and uh oh <laughs> yeah i hope this works oh gosh okay if i can just get my hair dyed today again i'll worry about my extensions another day but we'll see so don't judge <laughs> there's definitely spots that are i missed I feel like if i was going like platinum blonde that would be an issue but because i'm still going like lighter than my natural hair but still kind of brown it's not gonna be that big of a deal i could be totally wrong we will see but definitely the roots are lightening but like you can see right here that is obviously darker but again I, maybe it will be a big issue we're we're just gonna have to hop in the shower and find out I know when it comes to bleaching, you're supposed to technically start at the ends and I don't know what he's meowing. Do you want to go out? I don't know what his issue is. Okay, I know when you bleach your hair, you're supposed to start from the tips and work your way up to the root, um, which I didn't do because I had the mentality that I just dyed my hair. So there technically was no virgin hair, but it's still definitely processed faster than the rest of my hair. So my hair is like a couple different colors right now. The middle uh, is definitely still brown. I, do, I truly think I'll be fine. Oh, wow, there's a big patch of brown here. I think I, I honestly will be fine. Um, like I said, if I was going blonde, this would be unacceptable. I would definitely have to get more bleach and bleach all those, um, like, look, the, the patchiness out. But I think I'll be totally okay. Hopefully. I'm just telling myself that, oh, my hair feels so dry and gross. Mm. But um, yeah, we're going to let this completely dry and then we will go over it. I'll show you one more time the box. Bada bing. So it's a medium ash 
blonde. So go to a salon if I can't figure this out, but I think I'll be okay. I think I'll be okay. It's gonna be okay. Right? It's actually the next morning. I <laughs> kind of gave up last night. I got so frustrated. I dyed my hair so much. This is not the color that I was looking for. My color, my hair is about a thousand different colors. So I don't know. I just went back to the store, dropped after I dropped the kids off, and I'm going to try dyeing it a darker brown because blonde is not necessarily what I was looking for. I was just looking for a light brown, but um yeah well we will uh, i'm gonna go ahead dye this and see what happens if all else fails i'm just gonna slap on dark brown hair dye again because i don't know what to do and the next time i'll just go to a salon <laughs>